Hi, I'm John Costello. Um, I'm a field target shooter. I've been doing it for 11 years. We're going out to Germany tomorrow to shoot the World Field Target Championships. I'm not just going to be representing Team England, but Team Wild and Wheeltree as well. Field target started for me when I was a kid. Um, I was 11, I started with an Air Arms S200. Um, really good gun at the time. Um, from that, I did, start on, did my first winter league in the, uh, the following winter, because I started in the summer. Um, progressing my way through the ranks, um, won some big competitions. I started winning through my grids, so winning an A grid, then after Classic. Um, then went on to win or come second in the world, a joint first. I ended up getting beaten in a shoot-off, unfortunately. Um, but also went on to win, I've won the Grand Prix Series in the, uh, in the UK twice now. Um, won the British Master, British Champion. Um, I've also done the NAFTA Classic. Um, that was back in 2010. And I've just come back from Spain a few months ago, where I went and put in a, um, won the Spanish Open. It was really cool, it was the first time that anyone ever cleared a course in Spain. So, so doing that was, you know, it was nice not just for me, but for the guys out there to see it as well. I shot the World Championships, as I say, I came second out in 2009. Um, I've then done an eighth in Hungary, which is 2010. Uh, and last year I came fourth. So what I'm looking to do is go out to Germany and better that this year. So two most important things about field target. One is getting your equipment right and getting it to fit you and be comfortable. Um, the second thing is making sure that all your positions are right. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to go through my, my positions and show you exactly how I'm going to be shooting out in Germany. Okay, so the kit consists of, we've got a new sight on here, the 1050-60, um, with the John Harris side wheel. Works really well, really smooth side wheel. Um, we've got loophole quick release mounts, which just means whenever I go travelling I can take my scope and hand luggage, because you all know what baggage handles are like, and keep that separate, just make sure it gets there in one piece. I've also got a uh, Steyr Barley Twist Barrel of one of my older guns, just it's a, a little bit better with, um, you don't have to clean it as much, which for me is great, because I'm, I'm not the type of guy who loves to clean things. Um, we've got the woodwork, this is all a um, from Cobra Custom Stocks. We've got the pistol grip, the cheek piece and the forend. The forend's been made a bit longer, just so for you know uphill downhill shots so you get a bit better traction on the gun. Um, the gun itself is the new FT uh, LG100 by Steyr. Um, my preference, I prefer this to the older just because the cylinder and your chassis is a bit longer, it puts a bit more weight towards the front of the gun. So for me standing, it locks out a little bit better and just feels a bit more comfortable, feels a bit, a bit steadier for me. Um, butt hook, we've got an inch 456 um, and we've also got an offset uh, back end and an offset pistol grip as well. Um, we've also pushed the trigger off to one side as well, just so you can bring the weight of the gun more centrally over yourself. Just means that you get a bit better balance, not just in sitting, but obviously you need in standing positions as well. So this has been done, um, kind of pimped out by Hydrographics in York. Um, we picked the real tree um, AP snow design, I think it looks really nice. It's been white as well, it might reflect a little bit more of the heat which is why I don't think we have much, uh, much shift or anything on the scope out in, out in Spain. Um, and the rest's all been painted by Hydrographics as well. He's done it a nice candy orange. Some say it's a little bit camp. Um, I like it, but uh, yeah, he's painted all that out for us and it's, you know, I think it looks pretty cool. Okay, so this is my kit. Uh, I've talked you through that now. Now I'm going to show you how we're going to shoot in the even. Okay, you've now seen the gear, you've seen the extra equipment I use in my positions. So now, to, or tomorrow, we're off to, uh, off to Germany. Uh, you follow us step by step, see how we're getting on. There's going to be daily updates as well, so keep yourself looking on Team Wild TV, see how, how things are going, and see if I can put all this into um, practice. No pressure.